This is the most important discussion in the world today. Top five sandwiches ranked. I'm going to rank mine five to one, and I'm curious what you rank. At least it's number one. Number five is the spaghetti on garlic bread sandwich. I've actually never eaten a sandwich full of spaghetti, so that's not going to happen. Number four, the fried chicken sandwich. Only because it's a leg, and you know you can't fully enjoy that as a sandwich because there's a bone in the middle of that there. If that were maybe a fried chicken breast, it might be different, but then it would just be a chicken sandwich. And these are kind of like poverty sandwiches, mostly, you know, at least I was in poverty and eating these. So that's number four. Number three is the egg sandwich. Okay. I've had plenty of those in my life. Get you a couple of eggs, a little salt and pepper, a little milk, whisk, whisk, whisk. You got a sandwich on the go. Now, the top two, and I've spent hours thinking about this because these are the two sandwiches I've had the most. Now, the fried bologna sandwich is the sandwich I've probably eaten the most. Now, the sausage sandwich, and this, if you're curious, are the infamous pocket sausage that I had in my pants. It's a whole story, 85 South Podcast. Uh, these are the sausages that I had in my pocket. So I'm a little close to them, a little fond of those. I'd say, mm, for me, the pocket sausage sandwich got to be number two, and the fried bologna sandwich got to be number one. The ease with which to make it, bologna is what we had the most. And when I think fondly about my poverty-stricken childhood, most of those memories included fried bologna sandwiches. So to me, the number one sandwich on this is the fried bologna sandwich.